Alright, hi people, it is Shakes here, and I'm here doing several reviews in one, I guess, or maybe it'll be divided into two or three videos. Probably that. Um, I'll see. But, uh, yeah, I just got, uh, the Mystic Dragon and then, uh, the Delta Runner Zord and, uh, the Time Force, uh, key pack in, like, just a few or several minutes ago. Um, in the mail, so, uh, yeah, from Amazon, so, um, yeah, these are extremely, these are extremely cheap, I gotta say, it cost me a little less than 30 bucks, I want to say around 25 to 27 dollars, um, in terms of, um, uh, Amazon prices, uh, and I, um, had, um, a, I had like 30 bucks to spend uh, of money I got from for Christmas for my grandma on Amazon, so I decided, why not, you know? Um, so yeah, uh, this is probably going to be, no, tomorrow's going to be the last unboxing, hopefully if um, my stuff comes, but this will probably be either the second to last or maybe even the last um, unboxing of this year and reviews of this year, so... Yeah, um, actually, hopefully if I record it tonight, I'll get, um, my final Gokaiju review out, the series review out, uh, tomorrow, if I can record the last part and then edit the pictures in with the audio, um, tomorrow, so, and get them uploaded, so, yeah, lots of stuff coming, and be sure to check out my gaming channel, I've been uploading, um, Gameplay videos of uh, Batman Arkham Origins, Halo Master Chief Collection, uh, Sonic Generations, and just, I believe today? No, yesterday. Um, Dragon Ball Z Budokai 3 HD from the HD Collection, recorded with my Elgato Game Capture. So, yeah, um, link is on my channel for that, so just click my username uh, above the description and it'll take you there. Make sure to Open it in a new tab if you don't want to skip out on this video. So, yeah. Shameless self-promoting um, done now. So, um, let's get to this. And the final part, or the final bit of this, will probably be most likely for um, the forms I can get with the, uh, all, with the, um, these guys. The uh, Q-Rex, the Turbo Falcon, and the Legendary Megazord. Um, I recorded a version of that, but I think I might have accidentally deleted it off my laptop before I could edit it. Um, so yeah, or something, something happened where I only had the establishing shots I was going to try to do. Um, but now I'll get, finally get this, get that part out. Um, since I've been putting that off or forgetting to do it. So yeah, so get ready for, um, reviews, I guess. So, yeah. Alright, guys, I'm here. Hopefully if my iPod will stay up. Uh, to do my review, or technically unboxing, of uh, the Time Force key pack from Power Rangers Super Mega Force. Um, this is really the only key pack I really wanted, because Time Force is my favorite season. So, yeah. So, um, I might order more key packs when I get the money, but... Don't hold out on me getting all of them. Though it would be nice to have them. Um, so yeah, so on here, the packaging, you have the Time Force Red Ranger Wes uh, in Ranger form with his helmet holding the um, legendary morpher. Uh, you got the Time Force logo right there. You got, it shows you what you can do with the key other than what you can do. And then the flip action, you can get with the keys. And then a whole bunch of the other um, key packs, uh, that already came out, uh, you can, shows you even more of what you can do with the key, and, yeah, so that out of the way, let's get on with the keys, I have the Legendary Morpher right here, and so, we get, a uh, Time Force Red right here, I really wanted this because, again, Time Force is my favorite season, so yeah, and a nice paint job, and a nice, um, job done with the uh, sculpting and everything. I mean, um, these keys are okay. They're not as big as the Japanese ones, 
But one thing that they do have over the Japanese ones is that they can flip. So yeah, there's the scan, or there's the barcode uh, thing. So yeah, uh, he has key. Where is the number? Ah, uh, right there. Uh, PR015. Huh. Key's a bit big. Alright, now that I have that out of the way, the other two keys aren't going to make a different noise if you've seen like Dawson Riders reviews or maybe MMPR toys. The keys don't make a different noise because basically the keys are basically the same. The only ones that are different are the main team. Um, so yeah, so the the only keys that are really different don't make a different noise in the Morpheus. The same with the Japanese version is um, are the lit the pirate keys, so yeah, or the legendary ranger keys. Um, but on to this green time force ranger, and there's the barcode right there again, nice sculpt and everything, and paint job. So, yeah, so um, next we got time force blue. Oh, yeah, uh, green is PR. 15. That's weird. Um, so yeah. Then his barcode. And PR015. I don't get why these num are differently numbered. But yeah, that is my unboxing of um, the Time Force Keyback from Super Mega Force. Stay tuned for my unboxings and reviews of the Delta Runner and the Mystic Dragon from uh, the same line, but for the swords.